Hello everyone. Myself, Mr. Manjika Srina from LBH Arts and Commerce College, Nasik. Today I have come up with the most beautiful or you can say the interesting topic in mathematics that is future research topics in mathematics. It's a kind of a stuff or you can say that kind of a subject that is one should know that those who are interested to go for the future research in mathematics so those who are good in applied which subject should be or can be select those who are good in pure mathematics which subject can be selected for them we have some introductory part so let's see one by one so before that let's see what is mathematics so mathematics research is important because it is beautiful also an art form and more than that an innocent and collaborative art form performed by an entire community mathematics is not about numbers equations computations or algorithms it is indeed an about understanding by william paul thurston on the other hand paul Hulmers has the most beautiful statement about the mathematics the only way to learn mathematics is to do mathematics yes you have to sit down and calculate the things or you can have the mathematics is kind of a research or research in mathematics it's kind of uh, stuff that you can do in your mind also it uh, does not require any uh, much big machines and um, but big uh, chemicals lots of chemicals or lots of uh, calculations you can do it in your mind also you can have the new uh, contrast or new area or new things new concepts you can develop in your mind also so it's just required patience hard work and consistency so let's see what is applied mathematics some points of research in applied mathematics so there are applied mathematics one is artificial intelligence everybody has already heard the topic or the point artificial intelligence it's totally depend on computer science having applications of numerical analysis graphics and designing signal and image processing and the most important that is fractional calculus then we have the machine learning i can think that it is of a branch of engineering which requires the knowledge of numerical analysis 2d 3d graphics now generally we have 4d now also fuzzy logic that is the part of fuzzy mathematics and the fractional calculus once again you can see the fractional calculus though the fractional calculus is a recent topic it's a uh, lots of applications in applied mathematics also and in pure mathematics also then we have the most beautiful that is internet of thing you can see on the internet what that internet of things we have and what are the opportunities what the companies are doing things in iot if you are good in mathematics yes applied mathematics the iot is the best platform for you then we have information theory this is also best platform for applied mathematics students those who are interested so application having towards in signal processing communication theory as an application to coding theory cryptography and numerical application then we have quantum computing it's a part of mathematical logic those who have good in logic mathematical logic quantum calculus that is a calculus without limits cryptography and once again fractional calculus so these are the some few topics which you can have a future topics of research in applied mathematics then we'll come to the pure mathematics that is the mathematics most of the mathematicians always says that pure mathematics is the mathematics applied mathematics is not a mathematics the most one important on the beautiful subject is the fractals the most important application of fractals are used in predicts or analyze various biological processes the most important applications is in uh, bioscience the application of fractals then we have fuzzy mathematics because it is uh, fractals are nothing but the patterns it already deal with the, all the patterns so you can those who are good in uh, patterns and or the interested in biology also they can go for the fractals then we have fuzzy mathematics the most important branch of fuzzy logic having numerous applications in machine learning artificial intelligence robotic engineering etc then we have tqft the core area of mathematics that is topological quantum field theory which is an extension of quantum field theory that is qft and the manifold theory then we have topological information theory that is the topology and the information theory comes 
there we have to find out the loops in the information and related holes that is loops in the sense uh, whether data get leaks or some kind of a you can say uh, like going from this point to directly that point without uh, continuity that is a discrete data and so that is what kind of a loop you can say so then we have the quantum calculus also known for the calculus without limits based upon or having applications in quantum mechanics and the fractional calculus so these are some few topics i will come to the next topics also right now you can at least start doing the those who are interested start doing uh, reading the points now you have to read each word then go for the journals with related which are related to these points and start doing the research we will have in the next uh, video we'll have one by one and how to deal with these points how to go for the research in these points and what are the journals you should read uh, to each topic thank you thank you very much